DISCO is a FP7 European funded project which is really an alliance between ac academia and industry and its focus has been on generating new renewable sources for high value compounds. We're looking for alternatives to improve or reduce the environmental impact and so we've gone for renewable sources and trying to develop the production in plant, plant based systems. Well, some of the highlights of the results really have been the commercial products that have been produced and that involved the incorporation of uh, bioactives into cosmetics which was done through uh, an academic and industrial partnership uh, but also some of the new hybrids and uh, plant varieties that have been used for scopolamine uh, formation and also some of the pathway elucidation in terms of apocrotinoids and the ketocrotinoids. So one of the key points of DISCO is that we have been able to convert the euros that have been provided with to economic products as well as advanced scientific discovery. The DISCO project has shown and put the platforms in place where you can generate compounds that would typically be coming from uh, chemical refining but you can produce them in renewable sources so it's easier to produce natural products which the consumer wants. Uh, future challenges are really is the, still the commercialisation of some of the outputs but also convincing the EU that you must still keep funding basic and fundamental research because it add, adds value to your products in the end. The most important part of the project which is often overlooked is the training aspects. When you start the project you see a, a lot of talks and presentations carried out by the group leaders but towards the end of the project you see that now it's the early stage researchers that can uh, deliver and also describe their results and I think that's a, a wonderful thing to see over the course of the project.